Good morning, good morning. Um, Kevin at Leeds Harmonica here again. And I'm feeling pretty good today. I've got to say I'm feeling positive about the harmonica, which is nice. I've been playing quite a lot um, lately. I um, actually played out on Friday, which was good fun. Uh, but I'm going to talk about that elsewhere, I think. Um, what I've got today is um, I was working with someone... Um, on one of David Barrett's study songs uh, the other day called The Split, I Norm. Um, and there's a lick in the in the first chorus that's really, really interesting. It's kind of, it's fast and it's off kilter and it comes in at a weird time. Um, and I'm almost sure that it's a Little Walter lick. I'm sure I've heard it in Little Walter somewhere, but uh, my memory is is not great. I will leave that for the uh, historian sleuths. But if anyone can tell me where this comes from, then uh, I'd very much appreciate it. Um, lovely, lovely little lick, and the reason that it works so well is that there's a pause where you don't expect a pause, where you're ex your ears sort of naturally expecting to hear more music. So it almost feels like the harmonica players come in late but he hasn't. He's just been done a very cool thing and not played anything at all for a fraction of a beat. Um, but this chopping up, this uh, oddness of rhythm or lateness of rhythm is very typical of Little Walter. I think I've talked about it before. He'll often start on the end of the one, or weird stuff like that. Um, but there's not much more to say about it. Um, so let's just dive in. But before we do, because I'm always forgetting this, I've got a G harmonica, we're playing second position in the key of D, backing tracks in D. Okay, so this crazy lick, um, I'll just play it. Very strange timing going on there. Um, I'll just run through the, uh, the notes we're playing. So we've got three blow, three draw with the dip, four draw, five blow. Then we've got five draw, four draw, five blow, four draw. That's it. All together. So that's the first part. And then we are going to play something very similar. We're going to hit the three draw with the diff. Three draw with the dip, four draw, five draw, four draw, five blow, four draw. So we stick those two together. Now, the trick in this is in the timing. So we've got um, kind of a triplet kind of thing going on here. So we've got da, one, two, three, one, two, three, one. So the first part of it, the rhythm of it. One, two, three, ba da ba da ba ba da ba. One, two, three, one, two, three, one. Or one, one, two, three, one, two, three, one. <laughs> Which is a bit weird. Okay, so it goes. Ba 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 Okay. Now the next bit is very similar, but we are missing out that initial uh the initial note that comes on the beat. Um so it goes ba da ba da ba ba da ba 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 da ba da ba So it it's off kilter. I think the second bit when it starts is a it's kind of a triplet but missing the first part of the of the triplet so it sounds very off kilter um very little waltery in other words um okay so i hope that makes sense i've picked a very uh quite a chill jam track here to play along with and let's see what we can do okay <clears throat> Thank you. 
a bit more adventurous. track of the initial lick a little bit there, let's try and get back to it. Okay, there again, last one. I didn't realise I was at the end of the the, uh, the jam track there. Um, 
Excuse me, shut you up. Right, so that's it. That's the thing. Um, it's a really, it's a really fun little lick. Um, it works very well played fast as well. That was quite strange to play it at that tempo. I found it quite uh, different, and it makes the lick sound quite different. But anyway, experiment, different keys, different whatevers. But yeah, just think when you're improvising, just thinking about those little quirky, quirky rhythm things can be really cool. All right, see you next week.